New merch, ooh woo, which is pretty cringe. Recording my audio. Can you give me a little clap or something? I did it. You clapped? Yeah. How did I not hear it? It didn't come through. Dude, I'm clapping so loud right now. Genuinely, this may be a bit because I haven't heard a single clap. I promise you, you're going to look at all the footage. I'm clapping. My hands are closer to the mic now. My mouth is farther away. <laughs> I'm not hearing it. Every time I clap. I don't believe you sent me the footage. Did you hear this? This audio is cursed, but happy to be here. Welcome to my vault. Oh, is that the intro? That was pretty much it, yeah. I was gonna say, well, well, well. <laughs> if it isn't Mr. No, I don't want to do a vault cleaning video because everyone's done a vault cleaning video, but now I want to do a vault cleaning video. The video. Here's the thing. I ran out of ideas. Been there. <laughs> Your vault isn't even like that dire. You're 422 out of 600. So I went through a few days ago, 80% of what's in here I stand by. Scale of one to 10, how much are you wanting to clean? One is like, I want to get rid of 10 items. 10 is please drop a nuclear bomb on my vault. I'm low. So because I already have oh, like over 100 and 150, 100, 100. I have some amount of space that feels like enough. Mm -hmm. This is more of a father and son bonding session whilst also okay. printing money. Let's tab through because I am still noticing some dupes. There was a few where I like couldn't choose between. You'll notice four igneous hammers, for example. I do notice that. A lot of plug ones. That is surprising mm -hmm. for me. A lot of funnel webs, a lot of cantatas, definitely a PVP filthy degen. I'm seeing a lot of armor here. I didn't touch the armor literally at all. So the armor is an issue. Okay. As you can see, based on the number. Okay. 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 Warlock and Titan I don't ever play, so that's just an absolute graveyard of stuff. Okay. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> okay. What are you thinking? Let's see what we're what we're working with. I we can't get rid level. of this threat level, my guy. It is a relic of the past. This was such a good PDE role back in the day. Was it? Look at this. Surrounded threat detector. Surrounded spec. Reload. If it's that special, we'll leave it alone. You you actually don't have that many old weapons in your vault. Some other vaults that I've seen where people have like 50 guns from old stuff. So if you want to keep five, keep five. Who cares? <laughs> I see you have two spare rations. Who cares? It's a legacy weapon that has had such an impact on the game. And may I say, a few days ago, it was about five to six spare rations. So that's fine. This... I wonder why you keep. I'm just waiting with all these 180 rolls, like rapid hit kill clip. Do you think I'm wasting my time hanging on to this? Well, the answer is yes. Why do you want one with kill clip and multi kill clip? Well, I wasn't sure which was better between those two packs. So I was like, I'll just keep both because it F. The amount of times you're going to multi kill clip times three in PvP, how often do you think that's going to happen? Hmm, let me take my skill into account here. So yeah, probably never. I would just go with kill clip. I think regular kill clip is good enough. What if they buff multi kill clip? I don't think multi kill clip is going to get a buff anytime soon. But what if they nerf Kill Clip and then multi Kill Clip? Haha, <laughs> all of a sudden looking pretty attractive. How long has Kill Clip been in the game and hasn't been touched? Hasn't been touched in many years. Can you relate, my guy? 20 to 28 years old, been there. <laughs> I don't envision a world where multi-kill clip ends up being better than kill clip. I respectfully decline. The 180s, as I said, are a long-term sandbox play for me. I think, personally, you'll be taking this to your grave. <laughs> no, don't say that. But I'm that's just me. F. All right. This pulse rifle. Great pulse rifle. Yeah, it's a laser beam. Love it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Are snipers ever going to come back and truly be meta? Eh, next season we're getting the anti-barrier. It all depends on if Arbalest ever gets a nerf. But also this one. Uh, this is just the best one I found, I'm pretty sure. I could never work out what the best meta was for max impact shotgun. So it's like a mini quick draw plus handling playing grounds. I was like, yeah, I've seen worse. Can't help but notice it is still 1350. Yeah, so I haven't pulled it out. Um, which is surprising because I don't have any kids. So, mm, how's that working? Mm, 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 mm. Contraception, it's incredible. Why don't we look at some dupes? I'm not really going to fight you too much on some single rolls unless they're just absolutely pure garbage. Whereas the dupes, we can at least filter that down. Hawkmoon was just one opening shot, one range finder. So I think that speaks for itself. I can see you've definitely used both very recently. So that's cool. 13th, 5th. Yeah. <laughs> F you. What about these <laughs> SMGs? Dynamic Sway Iron Reach, Quick Draw Iron Reach, Dynamic Sway Iron Reach. I'd look at those Dynamic Sways and I would get rid of one. So this is the, the Stable Boy. This is the Quick Boy. How much would you say you can tell the difference of 78 handling versus 88 handling? 15% of the time in PvP. You can tell that you have 78 versus 88 handling. Yeah, if the point of the loadout is I'm trying to do a switch here, I think I can tell what's faster and what's slower for sure. Dead Man's is just, you know, one snapshot, one vault, one vault times a charm. Also RIP, this thing used to be glorious. Who knows how the hip fire change is going to work with the increased RPM. All good. Reese Walkers. Here we go. Quick draw iron reach, quick draw iron reach, surplus iron reach, hip fire grip iron reach. Let me walk you through it. Okay. <laughs> Full choke is bad these days. I would go to smooth ball, but ooh, it's even worse. Blech. Surplus aggravates me on principle. I feel like I'm being punished for using my abilities. So then why 
why do you still have this? I just can't bring myself to delete it because it's such a solid roll overall. But you hate Surplus. <laughs> I know, I know, I know, but they nerfed Quick Draw also. So it's like, oh, I guess I'm stuck with Surplus because Quick Draw sucks for pain. <laughs> Okay, is it in the Hitfire Grip one? Yeah, I just didn't know if Hitfire Grip was good and I've used it a few times and it just doesn't seem like it's good literally at all. So then why do you still have it? Because what if I'm dumb and it actually is good? <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. I want a video of you trying all the Reese Walkers out. But what would the title of that video be? Uh, Look, that's not what I'm here for right now. <laughs> okay, okay, that, that is separate. Extra. That's that is an add-on. Well, we're 17 minutes into this recording, and so far we have deleted zero. You know that sidearms are gonna have their heyday in Crucible at some point, so I want that optionality. The old optionality. Talk to me through these two. It's gonna be okay. PVE. You'll know what's better. Assault mag is technically better in terms of getting you more RPM. I personally don't feel like it's gonna matter. Like it's PVE, so like who cares? If you're using it for like raid boss DPS, yeah, it's a little more noticeable. But otherwise, mm, eh, eh. reload masterwork. You disappoint me. Ladies and gentlemen, we did it. I want to know why you're keeping the scout rifle top row third over. Perpetual Mosh Vorp. I don't like Vorpal in PvE on primary weapons. If you are using your primary weapon, it doesn't really matter that much because they're going to have so much health. Who cares? Well, just F them then. I would say F them. Got them. Cool. Um, wow, this one is garbage. Don't look at that. There's going to be some infusion fuel fodder that just ended up as a single somewhere and I missed it. Like that, for example. Um, No, I think I actually chose to keep this. I'll potentially be breaking shields. What do you think? PvE or PvP? PvE. I am not on the turnabout train. I feel like you must have a halfway decent primary slot bow. Now that's a good point. Literally get F. This is why you're here, my guy. These are the insights that I need. A couple of gnawing hungers. This hasn't been good for literally nine seasons, am I right? I forget if autos are getting a buff. I think max impacts are. Oh no, it's only for the super slow ones though. It's not for 600s. Yeah, that's what I, yeah. I literally just said that. All good, edit our slow mo, rewind, right. black and white. That's what I was saying. I think max impacts are. Thank you, editor. I actually <laughs> cut that. <laughs> editor, cut him saying that. The hand cannon all the way on the right. It's a 180. Opposite. Outlaw kill clip. I've told you. It's the promised land of 180s. So, <laughs> how many 180s do you need to hang on to with kill clip? I have another one here. No, this one's just a neutral snapshot range binder. Kill clip is a god tier perk for 180s because of the three tap. And that makes me think of Not Forgotten. And that was my favorite thing ever. A uh, go. Mm -hmm. Your retort. My retort is for every season that they're not good, you need to delete one. <sighs> that hurts. Yeah, that hurts to hear that. <laughs> That's why I have this posterity. <laughs> it's not Down to a maximum of one. <laughs> no. If they buff 180s, I am so here for it. Every season going forward, if 180s are not good, one gets deleted and I will check. Okay. Well, let me tell you, first on the old chopping block is this nature of the beast. If they don't buff them, it will be gone. Three truth tellers. This is all PVE, so talk to me. This was a blinding roll. This one is also a blinding roll. This is proximity. This is more of a PVP roll, which I know is toxic, but yeah. IMO, there are way too many good weapons in the slot. I would only use a blinding GL in the kinetic slot. Say no more. The Igneous. Oh, yeah. baby. I love the neutral handling on the Igneous. Yeah, you loved it so much that you didn't even mess work it. Listen, I love the optionality. That was toxic. Igneous, he didn't mean that. Subsistence, celerity. You really like subsistence in PvP. No, these ones I kept more for the handling speed, to be honest. I could do it without subsistence, but it's, you know, it's whatever. So would you ever use this one? Because I can tell that you have, because it only has one point of range on it. Mm. The ones that people actually use are Masterwork. And most right. of the time they have kill trackers on them. You don't use kill trackers, so I can't go off of that. But I can go <laughs> off of Masterwork. Which one would you like more? Listen, I'll probably get 90% of the value out of this one. It's pretty close. So this one probably don't need. Hit it. <sighs> That's tough. Boom. You'll never remember it's there. Deleting trials weapons hurts because LOL, imagine playing that mode. But you already have good ones. True. Name a weapon that we've deleted so far, other than Igneous. Mm. That is a good point, sir. And also, how dare you expose my brain power like this? Exactly. <laughs> exactly. The answer was Truth Teller, by the way. <laughs> Did I get partial credit for calling myself dumb? <laughs> I'll give you that. Okay. I couldn't even tell you which guns we've deleted so far. Who cares? Talent Drive, this one is Rangefinder. This one is not okay. Rangefinder. This one is a maybe PVE. PVE, okay. Death for all, one for all. So annoying to trigger. Doesn't feel good enough. Kind of a waste. Runs out too quick. 
What do you think? Disagree. It's not that difficult to proc, and it actually lasts quite a while. Agree to disagree. I don't know where fusion rifles have landed in PvP, so I was like, ah. They're still kind of kicking. Swash. <laughs> you're not getting a lot of special ammo in PvP anymore. You want perks that don't require a kill to actually activate, unless you're getting a lot of melee kills, I guess. I would have agreed with you until this season, Solar 3.0. I've been basically using nothing but throwing knives. All right, fair enough. And it is 1550, so I can't even take points off for that. I think, got it. Finite impact, uh, slideways iron reach, heating up iron grip, Killing Wind, Eye of the Storm. We've got three very different roles here. What are you vibing? Well, you're not vibing this hand cannon at all because your two masterwork ones are 1350. <sighs> I know, but what if Slideways Iron Reach is good? Uh, hang on one second. Okay. Yes. Let's ignore the fact that I'm not wearing pants and Danielle was wondering if I fed Brim. Cut that from the video. <laughs> I cut that. Wait, but can we massively pixelate it? Go, go for <laughs> okay, it. Okay, okay, yeah. Look, it's hot, okay? It's really hot. <laughs> I love what, it. What was the question? Slideways Iron Reach. So Iron Reach obviously makes this kick more than a 120, and it's a 140. However, the slideways, mm -hmm. if I slide into the engagement, this is a sniper rifle. What do you think? What makes you think I would know anything about this role in PvP? <laughs> That's a good point. I don't know either. It was just a theory. If you don't know, do you think I would know? Sometimes you surprise me with the things that you do know, so. I just use Freightbringer. Wow, that That's is cringe. That is the fattest view model known to man. I have explosive rifle. Browns Eye of the Storm. That's actually a really good role and also super yeah. toxic and also I hate that you have that. I don't know anything about that role. It's just something that you need to think about all the time. How much are you thinking? I mean, literally never. To be fair, you do literally slide into every single thing that you ever do. So this is basically <laughs> permanently on. <laughs> What hand cannon are you using right now? I'm using the crafted enhanced Ostringer. Do you ever see yourself going off of that? <laughs> Not at all, actually. It's five out of five, perfect god roll. Mm -hmm. When are you ever gonna use a different hand cannon? It's a very strong point, Your Honor. Mm -hmm. All right, we played guilty in this case. My only objection is these are energy and that is kinetic. Oh, go. Apples and oranges, IMO. I'll have to talk to my attorney about that one. <laughs> okay, the old apples and oranges defense. It is strong. All right, plugs. Let's see. We've got heating up, successful warm up. Killing wind, successful warm up. Heating up, successful warm up. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I quick draw corner. That's a different vibe. Killing wind or heating up for PvP. What are you going in with? Hang on. The third one has heating up and killing wind, I believe. Oh, wow. So now we're looking master work. Oh, this is getting into the real <laughs> nitty gritty that I just literally don't care about <laughs> at all. That's why I kept all of the roles. I guarantee if I delete the charge masterwork one, it's going to be like, by the way, this is a god roll only if you have the charge masterwork. I'll be like, no. Delete one of them, but don't tell the audience which one. Editor, just zoom in on the 416. Watch it go to 415. You are the weakest link. Never talk to us again. The audience is screaming right now. Who even cares? Comment section. <laughs> Find something else to care about. No, don't insult them. They've lasted 38 minutes into this video. I really need that engagement. <laughs> You're not going to edit any of this. No, no, no. We'll cut it. We'll cut it. <laughs> Dude, you stood up naked at one point. Arches tempo with dodge, impulse harmony. Look, you already have this one masterworked. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, it's 1558. Mm -hmm. The other one you haven't even touched. And also IMO, and this is probably gonna annoy people as well. The only thing that matters on a bow is what element it has so that you can do stuff in GM Nightfalls. Hot take. These two, oh, two heating up rampage. Interesting, why did I keep both of these? One is stability and one is stability. Interesting. I think this is the better role. What do you think? The non-masterwork. If you think it is, then I'm not going to argue with you. I'm never going to fight people on like, I'm going to delete this one. I was like, okay. But also you arguing with me is the best content we have. There you go. Please consider it. Fair enough. I saw Aztecross make like three videos on how good annual skate was. So I kept these two and that's all I know. Okay. I would keep surplus over triple tap, but also if you're not using it, who cares how good it is? <laughs> you're True. not gaining the effects of how good something is by not using it. Couldn't decide between the BXRs. I've literally never used this gun in PVP. So let's see. I've been using it literally all season. This is the main thing I've been yeah, using. Yeah, no, I know, I know, I know. I suppose you've seen my bids, huh? Yeah, you know, I've been known to watch. <laughs> Again, with the throwing knives, blunt execution. How often would you say you're using the blunt rounds? I was like, oh, is this a gimmick video with blunt execution? I know people were raving about that perk. Is that content? I probably will never get to it if we're honest. Then why do we have it? Wow, okay, this hurts. This is like, ugh. all right, fine, fine, fine. I think it took me ages to find blunt execution as well. So I was like, how can I delete that? But yeah. All right, well, you just did, so. Again, this is the one eighty promise 180s, land. baby. Here we go, Iron Reach. Imagine they turn this into a scout rifle one day accidentally. Not gonna happen, but keep dreaming. <laughs> okay, this one again. Gotta have that kill clip. We now have one of every <laughs> element with kill clip. Yeah, the other one was stability. Adaptive, 
Yeah, yeah, hover yeah. over adaptive munitions right now. Is this important? That's annoying that they both haven't. It. it makes me look like I care about that perk, which I don't. It's iron rage that I care about. Ah, oh, that is unfortunate. I know. Here's what I'm gonna say. If in season 18, again, 180s are not good, which they won't be. <laughs> One of these must go. Okay. And then in season 19, if they're still not good, which they won't, another one must die. That is fair. This one is getting a little out of control, I will admit. Especially because the sight is so ugly and annoying. I know I'll get frustrated as soon as I try and use it. <laughs> oh my god. All right, funnel webs. Let me PVE, see. funnel web. This is all you talk to me. Perpetual okay. Mosh, Rangefinder. Subsistence Frenzy. Beauty, love it. IMO, underwhelming. I wanted it to be better. Mm. Pulse Monitor, Focus Fury. I feel like this could be the mm. sleeper god roll. The dream is, and I haven't even used it, so I can't confirm, so you let me know, is there synergy between Focus Fury and Pulse Monitor? Shoot a bunch of your gun, then get Pulse Monitor to proc, and it still counts. Then I think that's somewhat good. Am I really going to care about all that when I instead could just do something like Sub Frenzy? Here's my problem with Frenzy. When is it working? When is it not working? I just never know if it's up or not, and I feel like it's never up when I want it to be. Your retort. My retort is it's probably up. <laughs> up more often than you think it is? Well, 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 if it isn't, my little friend, am I right? Mm, you're wee-wee. I got it. <laughs> there we go. We got there. What is going on with this one? It's an absolute laser beam. But you seem to have two of them. This one is perpetual motion, but no rangefinder. Ergo, if I'm not feeling rangefinder, sometimes rangefinder makes me sick. <laughs> and other times I'm like, wow, I need rangefinder desperately. I'm always out of range. What do you think? Mm. Fine. I feel like I've justified all of these roles pretty well. The Pulse Monitor, Focus Fury, mm -hmm. thing. like it's a neat concept, but also, oh, it's 1350, so you haven't literally even tried. What are the odds that you go try to make that work? If the comment section confirms that it's not good synergy, we will delete. But I think we wait for the jury on this one. It needs to be deleted or it needs to be masterworked and brought up to maximum level. <laughs> okay, and kill tracker on at yeah. least 500 kills in the next 12 and months. And then we'll check in. Yeah, yeah. exactly. <laughs> this is just a great role. I mean, you just love to see yeah. this. Haven't used it yet, but when I do, I know I'm going to love it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Actually use some of these guns. What do I like better? Come to a conclusion and then I would know what to delete anyway out of my inventory because I don't care. <laughs> And then one season later, it would all be irrelevant because the things will have changed. Exactly. <laughs> yes, wasting my time. I think I can safely get rid of this one. Then do it. Uh. Fugu. PBE. Old Fug. Four times a charm firing line versus auto-loading Focus Fury. I'm not using auto-loading Focus Fury because it's kind of counterintuitive. Okay. I think you could probably get rid of the first one. Killing tally? Or sorry, the second the second one. Second, wow, second. that's literally the opposite one to what you said. This is garbage, ignore that. This is garbage, ignore that. Okay, why do you have them though? So you just, Such yep, a point. Yep, I don't know, know why I didn't yep, them. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Power weapons, literally, who cares? I want to see those reads. Yeah, 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 okay. Triple tap firing line. With vice, beautiful. Triple tap bob. And what's the last one? Uh, I hit fire bob. Anything jumping out at you with the armor. Why do you have so many legendary pieces of armor? They are all just like power fodder that I've just been yeeting into the vault like as I'm playing and that I've just never dealt with ever. So you're not even keeping these for stats? No, 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 no. Most of them, or oh, maybe half of them are stats. Can you just like hover over some examples? Obviously stats. Jesus Christ. Stats, stats, stats. Garbage with power at some point. Stats. Mediocre stats. God, I'm cringing even looking at this one. Don't know why I have this. Stats. Uh, stats, stats. See, that is a helm that I would just delete. But the thing is, my warlock has so few choices, I feel like. I'm nervous to delete something that's this high. You think 61 is high? No, it's more the intellect for me. But the intellect's like not really that great. Mmm, true. This is garbage. Uh, stats. That's stats. not bad. Damn, dude. Where did I find this bad boy? D delete that. D yeah, 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 yeah. There's the first one that you get. Stats. Garbage. Go back. What? One more. That's 58. How did you work that out mathematically so quick? Because 70 minus 12 is 58. Wow, my brain just exploded in real time. Okay. <laughs> In that case, this can be deleted. Literally never talk to me. This has to be infusion fuel. I have so few resilience pieces that 18 resilience is kind of high for me. Because look, like 25 recap, <laughs> recap. Like, look at these recaps. Go back. <laughs> They're the same. They are the same. Oh, this was for, okay. Hear me out. Stay with me on this. When having different energy types was very important on like different sets of armor. These are both arc. I never got around to having to use it or need it, okay? But if I needed, let's say Void and Solar, I had some options to switch. 
Look, lady, whatever you need to tell yourself, uh -huh. delete one. That is fair. So which one of these are you keeping? I'd be keeping this. So infuse one of those into that one and then delete the other one. Is that even possible? I'll do that at some point Maybe. later because we're running out of time. Okay. You have five dragon shadows. But I love dragon shadows so much. Do you love it that you need five of them? Okay, don't need this one, obviously. And this one, God, I just find so many mediocre dragon shadow. How have I not found a good one? After I get off this call, <laughs> I want you to recording. No. The armor is just a whole thing, and I just don't care about it. You know what I mean? But then if you don't care about it, it should be easy to delete. But what if I need it? For what? I don't know. I can't question. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> you don't care, and you don't need it, and yet you won't delete it. Ah, oh, the yeet and delete. It's just so difficult emotionally. You're right. You're right. This is the wake-up call that I needed. And I want three deleted in the next five minutes after I leave the call. That is fine. And also, editor, cut this, and we'll end the video. Literally leave this in, <laughs> editor. If you cut it out, I will put it in my own video. <laughs> Secret outro. Okay, so I've been working on a new nutshell-style project for about two weeks now. It's a big boy. It'll be like a 17-minute video, probably. The script is five full pages. Because I've been working on it full-time, I haven't even touched Season of the Plunder yet. And I can only afford to do this because of sponsors like Apex Gaming PCs. Look, I'm not saying buying a new PC from Apex will make your ween easily two inches bigger. But like, doctors have been suspiciously quiet on this IMO. Apex isn't just a PC vendor. They're more of a transcendent lifestyle experience. Like Gandhi or Billie Eilish. Hey, treat yourself while the world collapses. And you may as well save up to $250 by using code JAZZ at Apex's website linked below.